Hello, Assalamualaikum and good evening everyone. Today, I'm going to show you my uh, heritage story about my ancestor dishes, which is called Samba Jawa. Uh, before that, let me introduce my, myself first. My name is Nuna Vikri Ben Zulkafli. And today, I'm going to show you my heritage uh, dishes, which is called Sambal Jawa. Sambal Jawa is commonly dishes for Japanese around Southeast Asia, including Malaysia. And my grandparent was from Japanese island from Indonesia who stayed in Malaysia. So whenever I go to my grandparents' house, they cook Sambal Jawa as main dish. And for sure, they will teach their ancestors, uh, such as uh, children and grandchild to cook the Javanese food as well especially Sambal Jawa Sambal Jawa or known as uh, Sambal Goreng Jawa uh, is serving on Nasi Ambeng uh, continues to be a favorite dish at dinner table of most people of Javanese descent of in Johor especially in Malaysia but it's originate originally from Indonesia Sambal Jawa is originated from Indonesia. It's prepared differently by people in Johor, Singapore, and Selangor as well. Uh, this dish is very popular during Hari Raya event where there are served dish uh, with nasi ambeng which is originated from Javanese culture too. And the main ingredient in Sambal Jawa is tempeh which is known as a fermented soya bean cake. And also to tofu which is known as a soya bean cake and also tanghun which is a glass noodles it's very delicious and plus sambal jawa is best eaten with rice cake which is known as uh, ketupat uh, it's served during special occasion uh, such as Eid, Eid al uh, wait and wedding ceremony as well there are nine ingredients in this uh, sambal jawa uh, which is firstly is tempeh secondly is tofu thirdly is glass noodle and also potatoes tofu skin ground chili paste tamarind juice water olive oil and don't forget uh, a blend of shallots and anchovies as well firstly we are going to uh, heat the cooking oil and fry all the potatoes for two and three minutes and also, we fry the hot tofu um, for around 5 minutes. And did you all know that tofu is very good source of protein that contains all 9 essential amino acids? So it's very good for your skin. Up next, we are going to fry our star here which is tempeh. Did you all know that tempeh has their own benefit? which is promote bone health, relief uh, hot flesh from monopause, lower inflammation as well. These are the ingredients that we need, uh, which is fried tofu, tempeh and potatoes that we have been stirred and fried, uh, shallots, anchovies and ginger blended, and also chili paste, tofu skin and glass noodles as well. And cooking time. Uh, firstly, we are going to heat the cooking oil and fry the blended until fragrant and oil separates. The blended, as I mentioned, is shallots, anchovies, and ginger as well. Next, we are going to add chili paste, tofu skin, and also glass noodle first. And also, we add on a cup of water and stir it until it's golden brown. And lastly, we are going to add all of the ingredients and mix it well. As you guys can see in this video, I didn't put any salt or sugar in this. But I only put Maggi Cukup Rasa all in one uh, which is a seasoning in it. A bunch of uh, seasoning and also a teaspoon of soy ketchup and then we take some plate and put it inside and ready to serve we are done now this is sambal jawa recipe from my grandmother 
Sambal Jawa is a special uh, dish for us as a Javanese people. Uh, we are serving it during special occasions such as Eid al uh, and wedding ceremony as well. And it's very commonly uh, to see people eat it uh, at uh, Salango and Johor State as well. That's all for my individual assignment. Thank you for all. Assalamualaikum.